Hi everyone and welcome to this week's Cyber Risk Engineering. We spoke about cyber risk modeling a few weeks back and a few questions came in about how do you best model threats and what are the problems that come with modeling threats. That's what we're going to be discussing in the video today. When we talked about cyber risk modeling, we looked at the specifics of how you take a problem out of the real world and then abstract it, model it in the concept of cyber threats, controls, how you run exercises involving penetration testing, red teaming, in order to come up with data to validate how your setup is operating effectively. So how do we then best describe and define well these threats? In the original video, I spoke about threat actors, threat sponsors, the capability that a threat actor has. I want to look at today with you the diamond model, which further goes into depth of how to best describe and define well a threat problem. In the diamond model that was published in 2013, you have four concepts. On opposite sides of the spectrum, you have the adversary and the victim. They're the opposing sides. Think of it as like a source and a destination IP address in terms of needing both sides of the coin in order to piece together what's happening from an attack perspective. Then on the left and right hand side, you've got capability and then you've got the infrastructure. So that's tied into sponsorship as well. If you think about how well equipped is your attacker when they're targeting you. That's in a nutshell how to best take a threat problem and define it in four further dimensions. So you've got the infrastructure, the capability, who the victim is, and then also who the adversary is. There you have it. Thank you for watching.